Miggy is gonna run away. He's got the clone fielding in. Here comes the hero's entrance coming from 5722. Flashes are being used at the moment, and Ragnarok available. Look at the damage coming from Faith. And there's the wombo combo we're talking about. Nike done package lining up for Sunspark to come under that barbecue here in the dragon. Yeah, Exosun a little bit separated into the fight, but it doesn't matter. Lea V's worth press that go button. Dragon is still alive, but secured by Faith. But he falls in the process. 5722, very, very low. Gambit actually in the back line, getting a couple of free hits. And Devil J actually falls in his hands. And now the supports are left. The mages are left. As Seth is the only one surviving. And at this point, this could be a potential dive. Look at the damage coming from Gambit. Explosive damage. There's the body slam. Healing. So I guess this is also... Sunspark. Yeah, that is the cast. That is the cyclone. They've managed to eliminate base as well. That is one man down. Oh, the rest of the Yabbies were just timing in, pouring in all their strength as Exo is 1v2 in temporarily. Everybody's low from the Yab, but at least they're waiting for that one fate to die. Then that is the win condition. 1v1. Exo. That's still with the Guardian Angel still not proc. There's the shield. There is that first kill in. But while the Guardian Angel was proc, he's still alive. But that's a 1v2 situation. As the Hulk just comes in, he is shielded. That is a ton of damage, Devil J, you madman. And even though Gambit oh. is golden, he is Whoa. vouching for that safety. Nixu, but the rest of the squad of Leob Esports comes in towards Sunspark because they're the ones starting the Baron right now. Again, they've got a ton of sustain. Oh dear me, Nikki's so low, but the cycle is still activated. There's the Yasuo ult. Their target here is towards Set, but it doesn't matter. He's golden. He's going to flash away. Just two members left. A Sunspark just trying to run for the hills, but it don't matter. Even though Nikki is still low. So let's take note, in the mid lane, there are minions marching down. That's the teleport. Will the stun kick in? Teleport doesn't connect. The three members knocking on towards the Nexus. Who is their focus at this point? And they're eliminating fate right off the bat, but it doesn't matter. The Guardian Angel just spawning back. It's gonna be too slow, and the Nexus falls. Leon Esports. Map a 2v2 situation, as we can see on your map, as oh. that Devil J actually getting shut down, and fate might be the next one to fall in the cast, or rather the big one. I not see that, but I'm pretty sure in the minimap, if you were aware, but hold up on, because it's oh, not Oh, that's the shockwave, but it don't matter, oh, as Miggy but this is a very confident play. I'm not too sure if this is actually safe, I mean, I mean, that's a teleport coming in. That is a teleport. Boots actually getting swapped out. He had enough money. And that will be the jungler down. Faith, Sunspark. They saw the jungler down. And that's a headbutt pull the right combo coming from Maze. Killer Instinct being activated as well to secure the back line. They're able to eliminate Exosin, but Gambit is still alive. Nice body slam. Flash combo. They're still alive. Of course, since we're in here, Nixu can back up even for the Exosin. Hold the thought because we have a Okay, what I deploy very, very deep trouble, but that is the cast. That is the binding activated as Maze is the first one to fall. Shockwave, but the body slam flash coming from Miggy is super effective. Nicely done hit, Dragon Rage, but now another fight ensues as Devil J is in the middle of it all. Actually, Trap got him down. Exo Sin Gambit. Anyway, he assists the siege. There's the headbot polarized. There's the kick on towards Exo Sin, and he's the first one to fall. And that's going to be a 4v5 situation for Leo, and they're not going to be happy about that. Ult, ultimatum use as Devil J will try to retreat to the fight, as that is the killer instinct used as well. There's a lot of bunch of focused targets here as the rest of Leo falls one by one. Woo! Actually, Leo is able to get that triple kill that, that Nexus is. They have the minion wave actually being there. Their focus is on the Nexus. No, their focus is on Devil J, but it don't, it don't matter. And they secure game number two for themselves. And Leo Beast ends this series into a 2-0 against Sunspark.